also hearing firsthand accounts from an Indiana couple in that baggage claim area when those shots rang out. Sam Carroll and his wife Kelly live in Noblesville. And we're traveling through Fort Lauderdale on vacation. RTV6's Chance Walser joins us live at Indianapolis International Airport with their story. Chance? Well, first of all, Erica, we've been here uh, all afternoon keeping an eye on security, which has been ramped up at the request of TSA. Also, all flights uh, going to and coming from Fort Lauderdale have been canceled for at least the rest of the night. As you mentioned, we're also hearing accounts from Indiana families who are among the fray in Fort Lauderdale tonight. Sam Carroll and his wife flew from Indy to Fort Lauderdale for a cruise. He says, though, right now they're among a large group trying to find transportation anywhere away from the airport. This comes after he says they spent hours on the tarmac of that airport with hundreds of others while authorities secured the property and questioned people. This afternoon, the Carol say is the most traumatic thing they've ever experienced as they walked around a corner to claim their bags and heard gunshots. We heard the gunfire and a mob of people came toward us and said, shooter, shooter, and they were running. So we turned around and ran in that direction with them. Uh, and then we, my wife wanted to hide behind a barricade, so we went behind the barricade and sat down and just started praying. And uh, and then shortly after that, we we got up and uh, we got we got out of the building. Sam says he has family about an hour away from Fort Lauderdale. They'll try to stay there probably tonight. The cruise likely canceled. Right now, they both just feel very fortunate to be safe. Live at the airport, Chance Walser, RTV6.